Silent Sam, the Confederate statue on UNC's campus, now getting louder, and now a national group has added its voice to the local activists. They rented two billboards in Raleigh to bring attention to the cause. WRAL Sarah Kruger is live now at UNC. Sarah? Brad, students and professors have been protesting the presence of this statue for years. Many of those protests happening right here at the base of the statue. Now, local act activists hope that this national attention will help bring Silent Sam down, while supporters of the statue say history should stay put. The call to take down Silent Sam in Chapel Hill is now high above the capital city, all funded by a national group. Black students each day are greeted by a statue that's an ode to the people that enslaved them. Callie Holloway is with the Make It Right Project. The new group is calling for the removal of 10 Confederate statues. UNC's is one of them, partly because there's a strong local movement. So we would love to help elevate those protests to highlight what they're doing, to add volume to their voices. One of those voices is that of PhD student Lindsay Ayling. The main problem with Silent Sam is that it was put up to celebrate white supremacy. Another, UNC professor Alta Cravey. I'm super excited that we have national attention. They believe the billboards will get the attention of Chancellor Carol Folt, who has previously said she does not have the power to remove the statue. She's going to stop saying that when she realizes that the UNC brand is dropping, that we look like racists because we are racists when we have a Confederate on a pedestal. The statue remains polarizing. This debate unfolded while we were there. A longtime Chapel Hill couple arguing it should stay. I think we should see those monuments. We should understand what they represent for good or bad and learn from them. So there's one billboard now up in Raleigh. Another will be going up by the end of the week. And that national group told me this will be a lot more than just billboards. They are planning a visit down here to UNC to see Silent Sam for themselves and to meet with some of those local activists. Now, as far as who can make that decision to bring Silent Sam down, that is also up for debate. Some saying that UNC could make that decision if they feel the statue threatens student safety. Others saying that decision rests solely with the State Historical Commission. Brad. Yeah, and this issue and the debate isn't going away anytime soon. Sarah Kruger, live in Chapel Hill. Thank you.